running for campus counselor because I've been highly involved um, in Wulusu the past four years, including this year. Um, I feel like it's an, uh, another step towards students. I feel like I can use my voice, um, leadership abilities, and communication skills to get through board of directors and board of directors and help uh, the students have a voice and make Grantford well known for themselves. The one thing I had in mind for Quiet Space is starting off at uh, the Student Center. Um, I believe that if we convert that space, the upper space, not the main part, the upper lounge into a quiet area, um, it'll give students the ability to go there. Um, people don't go up there because sometimes you have group meetings and stuff, but I find that you can use the main lounge for that. Um, on top of that, if that works out to be well halfway through the year and students say, hey, we need a little bit more space, I wouldn't mind looking into the uh, SC Johnson. Um, that way it's like it's another area that could be easily converted. You have cubicles around, yet you have community spaces, I guess, and say in the, in the middle, which can disturb people around them. So if we made that strictly quiet area, um, it could be a little bit more beneficial towards students. I haven't looked into it just yet, however I plan on it. I want to do my research right now in terms of what's the differential cost between the two, is it worth it, um, are there other options, so not necessarily like ebooks is like the idea is a starter, um, a backup plan that I have I guess is um, we all pay for the WLU library, um, however some of the course packs that we have that professors give us, um, we're paying double for those copyright fees, so in case the e-readers don't work out, possibly getting into my learning space and working with professors to use my learning space even more and more productive so we're not double paying as students for those copyright protections. Well first I want to start off as doing like an online basis having a suggestion online um, that way that people can go online from the comfort of their home if they think of an idea and bring it to us. Through the Wulusu? Um, yeah through the Wulusu website. Um, I believe also um, that we can do this as having like little drop boxes around campus. People suddenly get ideas randomly saying that we need different things and they think of it and they need a way to express it right away or else they'll lose it. So if I find if we have drop boxes around, little suggestion boxes around campus in the lounge uh, areas, uh, a starter would be in the student center just to get it going and seeing how well it does. Um, other than that, on a bi-weekly basis to get more towards your question, I want to be available to the students. Not just office hours in the Wulusu Wing, because some people feel that they're not more comfortable going there. If we bring it to the lounges, to Odeon, to Grand River Hall in the beginning, um, maybe we're providing a couple snacks, um, some drinks, that way students feel comfortable coming towards us, and that way they can find out either what's going on in Campus Council, what's going on around campus, um, what ideas we have for them, and what ideas they have for us, and that way we can try seeing what everyone wants. Mm -hmm.